Hey everybody, uh, especially those from uh, Shaving Cigar and more. I've got an unboxing video and I've never done one of these before, but uh, this one is super special. The Pantare has arrived. And especially for the guys in the group, I wanted you guys to see what exactly you're going to be getting, the packaging. Color of the packaging is different. The, uh, he uh, did a little different color box for the uh, admin team. But this is what it's going to come like. comes in an envelope. Wrapped in this box exactly like this. I have obviously not looked at this yet. So this is just purely, I'm going off of what the pictures are. And it says personalized for my name on the side. Really cool looking, you know, I like that it's wrapped. Let me put that aside. And then to kind of give it like that old world fashion, he did the melted wax to hold it in place. You can see it's... Got, can't see, I'm assuming that's the P there it looks like. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, break the seal. I hate doing that because it looks so pretty. There we go. Alright, probably could have gotten a knife. but So, there it is. I have yet to look. I'll let you guys have the first look of it in the box. So there you can go, it's got the uh, soft material there. Okay, I'll show it. Sorry, I'm just admiring. So, shaving cigars and more. Limited edition. Gotta be careful. I don't want to drop this thing like on day one. I don't ever want to drop it. You can see the logo that he came up with. The knot is tied. This is going to be a, he says it's, he hand ties them himself, 28 to 30 millimeters. This is the um, silver tip. And so I've got, when I do my shave, I'm going to do a test lather with this in a few minutes. Let the knot dry out a little bit, and then I'm going to shave here in a little while. And after it blooms out, I'll compare it to some of my other knots um, in the large size. But go ahead and take off the band. You can already see it's starting to, you know, it was tight. Now it's starting to flare out. The densely packed right there. And brush number one. Originally, I wasn't going to go with number one, but none of the other admins wanted it. So I figured. Uh, I thought Simon should have gotten that, but he chose a different number, so I picked number one. I've never had number one of anything. So this is phenomenal. The I love the fact that it's hand painted, handmade. There's it's got good size. Um, let's see, we'll compare it to some stuff people might already have. You got the original Plasson. You can see handle size to compare there real quick. Um, so not everybody has the 2000, a lot of people might have the 1305 Samogue. So you can see it's about, the handle height is about the same size and actually with loft of the Samogue 1305. So that's probably the most comparable. So just wanted to show this everybody, I am just blown away. This Pantaray is phenomenal looking. I can't wait to, as soon as I get done here I'm going to uh, start uploading this video and I'm going to start doing a test lather. So there you guys go. This is the brush that you guys will have coming. Those that aren't in the group, come on, check us out if it's a hobby, you, a combination of hobbies you might enjoy. But if you don't have a pan array, review will be coming, but I've only heard great things. So everybody, God bless and I'll catch you soon.